My title is Head of Collection Information and Digital Assets and what that involves is overseeing the database that stores all of the information about the art. I actually have to be in touch with virtually every department in the museum because everybody has a need to access that collection's information. I definitely feel that LACMA is a center of the city and it's a place to be. It's really great. It's very vibrant. LACMA is you know, has an incredible collection of over 120,000 works of art. And my prior experience was at Shangri-La, which has just a few thousand, but um, very different types of institutions. And so I kind of went, did a Goldilocks from a little, little baby bear's chair to papa bear's chair here at LACMA. It was affordable. I was living in Manoa when I took my first course there, and it just felt part of the neighborhood. I love being on campus, so that, I think that was part of the draw. And of course, just the many options of what to take. So it was kind of like a kid in a candy store. I would have to say that first museum studies course that I took, uh, that directly relates to my career. Um, Karen Kosasa at that time was just getting the program started. It's a graduate certificate in museum studies that is under the Department of um, American Studies and she uh, offered this prototype course that kind of blew my mind. I had really only ever thought about museums as being art-centric, and Karen Kosasa just opened up this whole new world for me of all the different types of museums there are out there. I think she put sort of a moral mandate upon me to help further the museum profession. <laughs> One of the things I really appreciated in my years at UH that I think is unique to UH and to living in Hawaii is that it's a small enough community that you can really feel connected to the faculty. They're so committed and so supportive and so accessible, which I think um, can be more challenging in much larger campuses. It's just the right size, really. I uh, really enjoyed being part of the printmaking studio scene. Printmaking is a, uh, a discipline that requires that people work together because you share the presses. So that's when I first really got a sense of belonging to um, kind of a tribe within UH. And um, so really great memories there. I actually learned to swim at UH as well uh, with um, taking a swim course through Hemingway Hall. From there, I went and joined the UH Master Swim Club at the pool. So that's another aspect of UH life, the, you know, the aquatic center there that um, was a part of my life for many years. Knowing what I know now, I would have enjoyed the journey a lot more and really been more open to all of the things that UH has to offer.